Hello, awesome parents. My name is Carissa Carter, and I have the amazing privilege of working with all the preschoolers on Sunday morning. So I work with birth all the way through kindergarten. Now, I know that this is might be a hard time that we aren't gathering as a church, and um, we may not be in physical contact with each other, but this is an amazing opportunity that you get to pour into your little ones right now and talk to them about what's happening. Now, weekly, what we normally do inside of the classroom is if they are twos all the way through kindergarten, we have a story time that a teacher is telling them live, okay? And then we also have a coloring page and a craft for them, and then we also have these worship songs that we play on a YouTube playlist so that they can worship in their own way with th songs that they can relate to with Jesus and learn more about him at their level and become actually a Jesus follower at the end of the day. That is what we always hope. But what we have done is I have went ahead and put those resources available for you guys. So down below is some links that you can actually worship with your kids. You can see them do the actions to their worship songs that they used to do and they are used to doing in Hope Kids every single week, Hope Kids Preschool area. You also have a link to a story video. And so you can listen to that story. It's only two minutes long on the story that we are doing this week is Jesus Calms the Storm. And I think that that is so pertinent to what is happening inside of the lives of all of these kids and even inside of you, um, what might be brewing inside of you as far as a storm. The other thing that I'm going to have down below is actually they do memory verse, um, memory verses as well in this age. And so I'm going to have videos to actions to our memory verses so that you can do those with your kids at home. Again, this is just an amazing opportunity and time that you have that you get to pour into your kids. And what I find as a preschool director is I'm creating these videos and I'm doing different things. These stories may just seem like stories, but they so apply to our lives as adults too. And as our adults are even sharing these, these stories with the kids in the classroom, we learn that it relates to our life and the application to our life is so deep and rich as well and so there's times that I actually even have to stop typing or writing things and go God thank you for giving me this word of God that not only applies to all these preschoolers but also applies to my life so I pray that as you go through the stories with your own little ones in your home this week that it would be able to apply to their lives and it would also be able to apply to your lives what a wonderful platform that we get to share with our kids how to endure storms in our lives because as little preschoolers they have their own storms in their own lives Lives, right like they got didn't get to play on the playground they're scared of the dark but as adults our problems get bigger that's what happens and as much as we need to teach them how to run to Jesus in all of what seems like little problems in their lives as adults it's building blocks to then as bigger problems come to them then they know how to um, apply that same principle to bigger problems that they have in their life where we ultimately need to run to Jesus. And Jesus also says in his word that we need to become like little children. So I pray that during this time we become like little children and we allow ourselves to sit in the lap of God and his arms just to wrap around us. Jesus is with us no matter where we are, whether we are in a church building or whether we are at home. God is there with us and he is there with you and your children this week. So be encouraged and be blessed and love on your little ones.